Hey, what's up everybody? It is your girl Ashley again, and here I am with another review of Love and Hip Hop Atlanta. Check yourselves, Season 6, Episode 5. Okay, so um, we're just going to get right into it because it wasn't all that much to it. But you know, we're going to do what we do and break it down like we do always, okay? What up? Where you been, man? Hiding, man. I don't know. I already know who the best poker player in the house is. I know how you, you know what I'm saying, do my thing. But, you know, some of these cats right here pull up games so good, they can't help but be the best poker player. See this tango? This tango. Earn this tango. We always link up, you know what I'm saying? Me, you know what I'm saying? Steve, y'all, even my homie Bobby, you know what I'm saying? But, I heard this. Where you come from? Where you been? I was in Miami. You was with the wife? Ain't hey, no wife. No wife, people scrappy. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if I believe it. <laughs> what you wow. talking about, Leslie? I'm single right now, man. Uh, you know, but why? What was up with Josh? I, I ain't seen her in like seven and a half months until the other day. I got served with some papers for a maternity test and all that. So, I'm gonna take the test and all that. Man, that's crazy when you get served with a maternity test paper. Now, Mona, I understand, understand thoroughly. You got to keep this ratatouille shit running on around there. But everybody that's anybody know good and damn well that baby is um, Stevie J's, okay? Everybody know that. The thing it with the women is as much... Um, as Jocelyn and Steven, Steven, Stevie seem to share the Punani um, as a couple. Even though all that foolishness was going on, you can see that that woman loved that man. And the thing about a woman, when she loves a man, baby, ain't nobody rocking that boat but him. Okay? And I guess them other women that. She was letting lick the thing down there. But this storyline was just unnecessary. We all knew that baby was Stevie's, and we don't need to see this whole little show y'all going to put on with this baby um, being born. Because if it's as fraudulent as that shit was with Mendeecees and Yandy and that non-marriage ceremony they did, you are just not to be trusted, Mona Scott, at all. Go to Quill. We're going to take care of that baby. You didn't have to. I mean, I'm not happy. You know? I had a minor setback. When you say it's a minor step back, like a minor setback on what? You <laughs> feel me? Because you can step back, but you say it's setback, and where you going? And for what? Me and Rashida's relationship was kind of on the rocks. A little bit too much drinking, hanging at the club, some broad named Jazz. I slip. I, 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 Say it's crappy. I know what you're going through, because guess what? What? I smashed Jasmine too. I hope you didn't do the naked <laughs> You feel me? Like, like, tell me. Please, John. Please, you feel me? Because if you did the naked <laughs> to all three of y'all, Hundu, Kurt, and y'all should have stuck it in at the same time. Just suck the hell out of this whole damn situation. Kirk, you get, Kirk, you ain't even a third of a, fourth of a fine to be running around getting in all these women. That's why halfway the shit is unbelievable. Don't nobody want your dusty ass but Rashida. Ugh. Young and the rest of us is fake storyline. Next thing you're about to see is giving treasure a little fruit salad. Before the massage, bitch, get the life of, okay? 
Wasn't nothing wrong with her body. Stop that um body shame. But get out that outfit. You showed up, bitch, so why say you ain't gonna come? You shouldn't have came. I wasn't. Got the drop that you was trying to apologize, so I'm gonna hear that. I love what a bitch like to stroke my ego and let me know that I am who the f I think I am. Hell, you know, At least she said it right. Who the fuck she thinks she is. Bitch, it's not a motherfucking vibe. When you talk crazy to a motherfucker like me, bitch, the vibe is dead. Like me and you, you just like a disconnect somewhere. Oh, the disconnect when you told me that I was lower than you. I didn't say that you were lower than me. I said that you were low. Stop the hand movement, bitch. Back, 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 back,
a bitch on clothing from something that would hurt her, like shoes, earrings, whatever, that would hurt her in a fight. It's clue number one that some shit is coming down. Clue number two was her standing up. It was no point, okay? It was no point. Grapes wasn't that deep for her to get up and go get some grapes. And then when she threw the first grape, the fact that you grew, threw a grape back showed that you wasn't about that life because you should have snatched her ass up right then and there for throwing a grape. Don't throw shit at me. We grown-ass women, okay? Now, you went there to apologize, so you say, but you should have came at it better. You should have just started out with an apology saying, you know, I was wrong, my bad. I was dirty for saying how I said it in front of strangers, and, you know, can we start over? That's how you should have said that shit, okay? Because Tommy do seem like she a little bit a little bit reasonable, you know, when it comes to things like that, okay? But I may be saying that too soon. Now, like I said, this is check yourself, okay? This is um, on the internet. They don't put this on TV, which is why I don't know because this this commentary right here is better than the shit on TV, in my opinion. If you think so, let me know down below. I don't. I, I mean, that's just my opinion. But you know, hey, whatever. Whatever, whatever's whatever, I guess. You know, at the end of the day, as they all say. But um, anyway, so that's that, you know, um, they run, they run thick with this married whole thing. And, you know, Tommy always going to be fighting some damn body. And girls, stay out that um, top and any type like that with busted breasts, as, you know, them busty breasts that you got. So, you know, thank you for watching. Share, like, and subscribe. Um, enjoy your Easter weekend. Be safe, like I said. You know, stay fresh and clean, cause you know we all go. You know we all gonna be okay. No, the internet gonna be flooded with pictures tomorrow of everybody being so nice and so clean. So everybody, be safe though on a real tip, okay? And have fun with your babies and your family. Any good, and most of all. Rejoice for the whole reason that we are celebrating this day, and it's not because of a damn bunny, okay? All right, let's get that clear. Okay, so you know, everybody, thank you for watching. Be blessed, enjoy, and see you guys next time. Bye.